This is the Olanzi Claw quick release camera system. Let's open it up and test it out. So this is the combo set of the Yulanzi Claw quick release system. It goes for 48 US dollars on Yulanzi's website. Links of course would be down below in the description. And in this set you get a camera backpack strap mount to mount it on your backpack. And you also get a base mount to mount it on your tripod, on your gimbal, or anything that has a quarter inch thread on top of it. The load bearing of this thing is 50 kilograms. It's very, very portable and tiny and it's supposed to be very, very efficient and fast compared to something like the Peak Design Capture System. So let's open the boxes and see how efficient it really is and if it's worth buying or not. I'm gonna start with the base mount. This is the base mount. Has a quarter inch thread at the bottom. Very, very small and tiny, as you can see. Very, very portable. Has one button on the side with lock and unlock feature to lock the base mount inside and unlock it if you want to. And on the other side, you have a button to remove the base plate from the base mount. And the way you remove this base plate is simply press these two buttons at the same time and remove it and then you can put it back in and lock it if you want to. Very simple. Another thing that I want to mention, it doesn't matter really how you put the plate inside. So you don't really have to look for anything, you just put it in, push it inside and then you can lock it so it won't wiggle around and your camera won't fall. And this is the camera mount, looks very similar to the Peak Design capture mount, but obviously with its own mechanism. Again, it has one button in here, one button in here, does the same thing like the base mount. Press both of them together to remove the plate, put it back in, lock it or unlock it. It also comes with a coin that says Yulanzi on top of it, and you can use this coin to screw the screw at the bottom of your camera. This mount as well is very, very compact as you can see. And the way you mount it on your backpack is very simple. You undo one of those wheels, or maybe both of them, and then you put your backpack strap in here, close it, and screw back the wheels inside, and that's it. Okay, so now let me show you quickly how it works with my phone and my phone mount so you'll get an idea how to use this thing. And afterwards, obviously, I'm gonna do more tests uh, with this thing and my backpack so you can see how to mount it on your backpack and so on. So first of all, obviously, you need to mount this base plate on your tripod or a gimbal or whatever else. Again, that has a quarter inch thread. Then I'm going to take this plate out and I'm gonna screw it at the bottom of my phone mount, which is also made by Yulanzi. I love Yulanzi. And again, it doesn't matter what direction you're gonna screw this plate in. They're all the same pretty much. Okay. I'm going to also use this coin to make it a bit tighter. So now I have my phone on the phone mount and at the bottom of the phone mount, I have the claw system plate. Now I can put it in, lock it, vlog, or do whatever I want to do, okay? And for example, if I had a backpack and this was on the backpack, I could simply remove the phone and strap it on my backpack, lock it again, and now I have it on my backpack. And if I want to change it back, press again, two buttons here, remove it, put it back in, and start vlogging. And obviously, if you have more of these mounts on many of your tripods, gimbals, you can just quickly change between them, like one, two, three, four, and if you have many cameras with these mounts, 
you can do the same thing, just change between mounts, tripods, gimbals, very fast and efficient without even having to think about anything, you just slap it in and it's inside. You wanna take it out, press two buttons and mount it somewhere else. All right, so now let me show you how to mount this thing on a backpack. So this is my camera bag, the Peak Design Everyday Sling version number two. I've made a video about this bag. If you want to watch it, I'm gonna leave a link up here. And this bag has special mounts on each side, one here and one here to mount the Peak Design capture mount. But I'm going to use this Yulanzi claw mount because it works pretty much the same way. So it's very, very easy to mount. Like I said, just undo these two wheels in here as much as you can. And then it's gonna open up like this, like a butterfly thing. And then you're gonna slide it in. Or if you have a backpack with a strap, you're just simply going to put your strap like that. And then you're going to close it. Adjust it as needed. Okay, then you're going to close it like that. So the strap is gonna be in between the mount. And the mount is now on my bag. It's very, very secure. As you can see, it's not going to move anywhere. Let me show you quickly how it looks, if I'll be able to focus. And since I don't have a spare camera to mount on this mount because I'm using my main camera right now to shoot this video, I'm going to show you how my phone looks on this mount. Sorry for that. So remove the plate. And then here again, you press the two buttons on the sides, remove it very fast and mount your camera, your phone, maybe your GoPro, whatever. You can lock it as well. And now your camera, your GoPro, your phone is gonna stay here and not move anywhere, just like so. And obviously, for example, if you're going to wear your backpack or a camera sling like I have, you're gonna have your camera sling on the side and then when you want to take a picture, you bring it back to you, press two buttons, take your camera out, take a picture, and then when you're done, you just put it back in, lock with the locking mechanism, and continue walking around. And if you have a backpack with two straps, one here and one here, you can put the camera either on this side or on this side, take the camera out quickly, take a picture, and put it back in. Pretty much it works the same way the capture thing works from Peak Design, but a little bit more efficient and faster, my personal opinion. I also forgot to mention that this mount is built completely out of aluminum, so the build quality is top notch. Even if you drop this thing on the floor, nothing will happen except few minor scratches. Anywho, guys, I'm going to leave links down below again for this claw system. And if you have any questions or comments, let me know down below. I hope you found it informative and I guess I will see you in my next video. Thanks for watching.